there was quite a change in a progression, I should say, sort of stylistically, mm-hmm. I thought, from the first to second album. Was that intentional, or do you think that was just something that came naturally to the band? Yeah, I think they just came naturally, honestly. We were we were so young when we did the first album, and we didn't have much, you know, of self, you know, um, awareness in a way. We didn't, we just sort of, like, we're writing music and we didn't really think about it. We we didn't really know ourselves that much, or at least I felt that. I felt like I didn't yeah. really know myself that much of, in that moment in time. Um, we were quite, you know, new to it and, you, you know, we were young. And I think at that point in time, you know, the best thing came out of it. And I loved the first record. Um, but we had a bit more time to sort of like think about where we wanted to go on a second record and naturally I felt like I love you know the 90s era slash 2000s era and for me I had that you know like I think it was two and a half years in between three years almost to like sort of like figure my shit out and figure out you know how yeah. I wanted Pearl Wave sound and that's yeah. the kind of music that I adore and I was able to sort of get to that point where you know I wanted to sort of, I don't think it's drastically different, but I feel like it's, Mm. it was like a necessary change for me. It was notable, notable, but not too, not too much. It was. Yeah, exactly. Like, I don't think I could have done another record that was, you know, all twinkly 80 cents. That's just really not me Mm. that much. Yeah. So then obviously you're in the studio now, aren't you? So how how does that progression follow on now to the to the third record? What what's it sounding like at the minute? It's not that drastically different to the second record, but I would say it's a bit more aggressive. Mm. It's a bit less soft. It's more guitar, like electric guitar driven. It's more hard hitting. It's yeah. not as delicate. Okay. Which is, you know, which is I think fun for us because. Um, me and Kira, we've loved like pop punk and you know um, more sort of heavier music since we've been like fourteen. Like I was in a pop punk band before Pale Waves. Never yeah. went anywhere, obviously, but um, <laughs> it's really good to sort of go back to those roots too, and yeah. sort of you know live out our pop punk dream in a way. I'm not saying it's a pop punk record of no. any sort, but it's definitely more influenced. It's probably the most like pop punk that we've yeah. ever sounded I would say 